Philips developed a unique wearable technology to measure, interpret, and predict stress effects, emography. Emography Skin Conductance provides real-time insight in short-term daily stress and predicts the cortisol contribution that can influence the body's overall performance. In wearables, the trend is moving from measuring physical fitness towards measuring mental and emotional fitness in combination with physical fitness. A healthy lifestyle requires physical, mental, and emotional fitness. Stress plays an important role in this balance. What is stress? A definition. Hans Seeley defines stress as the nonspecific response of the body to any demand for change. There are many types of stress, physical, mental, emotional. The body does not differentiate between these types of stress. Independent of the source of stress, the effect on the body is the same. Emography continuously measures and interprets stress and makes it easy to understand by showing stress levels in three zones. Balanced, understimulated, and overstimulated. This way, emography raises the wearer's awareness of bodily signals and enables smarter ways to deal with stress. And emography is able to predict stress 60 minutes ahead thanks to algorithms that calculate the cortisol contribution of stress. How does the body respond to stress? A stressor triggers a fast neural and a slow hormonal path. The fast neural path releases noradrenaline and acetylcholine. The slow hormonal path releases cortisol. The fast path is used to determine the current stress level. The slow path is used to calculate the cognitive zone and the prediction. By using the cortisol contribution, we are able to provide insights in a person's performance now and in the future. It can be very useful to know an upcoming cognitive zone. For instance, it may be relevant to know that a commute to the office was quite stressful. When arriving in the office, the cortisol increase caused by the drive can affect an important presentation in the office 60 minutes later. A relaxing exercise in the car can help to cope with the stress and prevent a decrease in cognitive performance. A laboratory validation study demonstrates a good correlation of measured salivary cortisol and calculated cortisol. 46 participants doing various validated stress tests showed a mean correlation of 0.48. This is solid academic proof that the cortisol contribution algorithm reflects changes in the body's cortisol level. Let's see how it works. We use a VR set to show immediate results. The person on the swing experiences immediate stress, which can be seen by the skin conductance signal going up immediately. A relaxation exercise is performed to lower the skin conductance signal. Another stressful event shows again immediate stress. The current stress level is high again. The cortisol is still rising due to the first event as it is a slow response. The total overview shows the stress level peaks immediately, whereas the cortisol contribution takes a longer time and will be affecting cognitive performance a long time after the stressful event. Emography, insight in stress. Please contact us for more info on emography and its interpretation concepts.